Hey everybody, with me is Andy Cappy, thoroughbred racing on my hometown track at National Race Course in Granville, Pennsylvania on Monday evening, April the 18th, and this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 3 this evening, folks, 6.49 p.m. Eastern Post Time. 8.3 furlongs, that's a mile and 70 yards on the dirt track, 3 year rolls and up race for an optional claiming purse of $34,000. Contenders number 1, Moonlight Grinder, number 4, Straight Thunder, number 5, Tap Tap I Win, and number 2, Dance and Dixie Cat. Number 1, Moonlight Grinder is the pace profile leader in this optional claiming field today, racing at or about tonight's distance of a mile 70 yards on the dirt has hit the board in each of his four career starts to date, winning three times, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Jockey Angel Rodriguez and trainer Bernard Hopton send him to the post tonight. They've hit the board with 62% of their last 50 entries saddled as a team to date. Number four, Straight Thunder, an 8-1 to one shot, has produced a trio of power runs in his last four outings, hitting the board in a pair. Race 3 summary, number 1, Moonlight Grinder, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 4, Straight Thunder, number 5, Tap Tap I Win, and number 2, Dancing Dixie Cat, 1, 4, 5, 2, and the third tonight from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Beulah Park in Ohio, race 4, the 6-1 to one shot, number 4, Sunnyway, takes a class drop of 5 units, the overall speed leader in his allowance field, sprinting at 6 furlongs on the dirt. Finger Lakes, Upstate New York, race four, number four, Blue Horseshoe, a four to one shot. The overall speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at or about today's distance, a four and one half furlongs on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Monday night, Rick Data for Day at the Track .com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it. <laughs>